Welcome to Compton. What up, man? Okay, Dr. Dre. Okay. That's <laughs> where it all started. We put it all in the music, all our frustration and anger. Our music was like our weapon. And that's the most powerful weapon we got. What's up, man? What a lot of people don't realize about in way it's nonviolent protest. We let people know that it's OK to say what you want to say. It's crazy to see how all these different people around the world feel the same way that we feel. We kicked the door down for a lot of artists. Game time. What's up? What's up? The foundation that was set by y'all, man, I'm so appreciative. No, I just try to keep the flame lit. What's up? What's up? When I think of N.W.A., it wasn't really music to me. It was more like a real lifestyle. Brothers from my neighborhood that made it out. The same thing that we was going through in the 80s with the police people going through right now. It's a good time for us to tell our story. Some kids from Compton, how we touch the world. one you know nigga <laughs> you got them rocks that hard shit you know that's all i do i got a cold ass beat that hardcore reality rap so what you talking about doing cruising down the street in my six hey that was dope eh that shit was dope man you a genius <laughs> what's nwa stand for anyway no whites allowed something like that <laughs> no niggas with attitudes idea how many records you're selling? NWA's arrived, you're fucking huge. Dangerous motherfucker race in hell. And if I ever get caught, I may fail. See, I don't give a fuck. That's the problem. I see a motherfucking cop out of the Your songs, they glamorize gangs and drugs. Our art is a reflection of our reality. The Rodney King beating was a shocker. Guys like you change shit like this. This is a...